Today I'm going to tell you the most sad story in Irish history. This was one of the most difficult times for Irish people, especially Michael Collins and his National Army. So let's jump back to June 1922. Six months after the Anglo-Irish Treaty was introduced, the anti-treaty IRA were occupying the four courts in Dublin. On the 22nd of June 1922, two London-based IRA members actually murdered Sir Henry Hughes Wilson. And as you can imagine, that absolutely furiated the British. The British wanted the anti-treaty IRA out of the four courts in Dublin. They threatened Michael Collins and the pro-treaty members and they said if they didn't get the anti-treaty IRA out of the four courts, that the Anglo-Irish Treaty was called off and that they were going to re-invade Ireland again. Michael Collins did everything he could in terms of getting a new draft of the constitution so that they wouldn't have to swear an oath to the crown. And the British refused this, which left Michael Collins and the pro-treaty with two choices. Cancel the Anglo-Irish Treaty and have Britain invade Ireland again? or attack the four courts. Winston Churchill provided the 